Hello teachers and anybody who works with kids. My name is Joe Karlovsky. I am the super brave teacher. Yes, I am on a mission to tip Google, YouTube, and the world in a radically positive and accepting way for all LGBTQ plus teachers and students. And give you some lessons along the way. Something that I wish I was told many years ago. And here I am, two things, two things, just two things that please, please, please do more of. Please do more of this. So yes, friends, I'm gonna keep it simple because that's what good teachers do. They keep it simple. So a lot of people think that in education, you gotta measure every day. You gotta be having those tests and you gotta have all these things to show the results. Yes, 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 that is important. Data is important. But you know what's more important than data? You know what's more important than having all these metrics to show how successful your children are? You know what it is? Celebrating their success. So make sure every day you are celebrating these kids. And also make sure you're celebrating not just their success or not just every time they do right, but just celebrating who they are. The more you have a classroom, the more you have an environment, this school of just celebration, it gives them the ceiling of like belonging and like, wow, not only do they see me, but they are celebrating who I am. And you can only imagine how impactful that is on your students and how much that resonates with them and how much that continues to just resonate with you because Happy kids, happy teacher. Am I right? Am I right? Also, the final thing, I hear a lot, you know, actions speak louder than words, all this stuff. Yep, that's true. Actions do speak louder than words. And you know what speaks louder than actions? Consistency. So yes, celebrate those kids. Celebrate your students a lot. But be consistent. Consistency is way more important than a great action every now and again. Every now and again, however the phrase is. Every now and then. Consistency. Be consistent with your students. They don't care if once in a blue moon you say some kind words. They don't care if once in a while you're kind to them. They care if every day you are consistent. It means so much for their brains, their hearts, their spirits. So be consistent. So let's give you a little quiz. What are the two things you gotta do? What are the two little takeaways you're going with from this video? You already know it. Celebrate, 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 and be consistent. Be consistent. Especially we are now entering April. This is the time of the year where teachers are like, yeah, I'm gonna put it on. No, you cannot put it on overdrive. Trust me, the kids know when you're putting it on overdrive, there's no such thing. You cannot punt. Teachers, do not punt in April. Please do not punt. Don't do this. And guess what? Celebrate, start celebrating now. Not just at graduation, not just at cultural fairs, not just at big celebrations. Celebrate every day. Because we have this beautiful thing called life that's worthy of celebrating. So yeah, there you go. Thanks for watching this channel. You are awesome. You are important. You are super and brave because you are you. Celebrate that. Celebrate that. Consistently celebrate that. Consist consistently celebrate every time you show up. And I am intentionally leaving all my blah, 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 blahs in this video because I want you to see that me being me is way more important than me being this perfect person. So thank you, Joel, for showing up and being your super brave self. I love you all. Bye, folks.